2002 to 2005 were the seasons I played. Um, I got here in uh, or August of 2001 and redshirted and, and then uh, played as a redshirt freshman and the rest is history. Jamie on the option again, goes to Moore, escapes one tackler, down the sideline, one man to beat, he's got help, turns it back, touchdown, Dontrell Moore. Six My family kind of migrated, they were in Clovis, New Mexico, and then my grandma ended up coming to Roswell, and then they just were in Roswell, and that's where I was born and raised, a proud coyote. So it was a crazy recruiting process, I didn't really like it. Chose New Mexico, wanted to be close to home so my mom could be at every game, and um, support me. She never missed a home game in four years, and that was that was important to me. He's my heart. He's very important to me, and I love him very much. He's a good kid. He said that basketball was his first love, but that you were the one that convinced him to play football. How did you know that he'd be something special? I didn't know. I just wanted him to have something else to do. <laughs> She's my rock. She's my world. She always has been. You know, our relationship has changed over the years as I've gotten older and older, but at the end of the day, she's still She's still um, an amazing woman, um, an amazing source of uh, strength and pride for me, for sure. A lot of easy internal motivation. I've just always been that way. My mom talks about it, she laughs. You know, she'd get home from school and I'd have all my homework done, all my chores done, you know, have dinner cooked for her, you know. So it was just, just, just in, etern internally driven from day one for whatever reason. So I wanted to be the best at whatever I was doing, so. Coming to a school where a head coach and an offensive coordinator believed in me. And so it was imperative that I had myself mentally and physically fit to carry that burden. And, um, and, I, and it's one that I embraced and truly embraced and still do to this day. So to still be number one all time in uh, Lobo history, number two all time now in Mountain West Conference history, which still means a lot. It's just an, a tribute to the hard work and dedication and to having a lot of people support and be in my corner. Playing for the University of Mexico is, is unlike any other place in the country. They'll love you forever if you if you've you know done amazing things for them or if you you know wore that jersey with pride and respect, then they'll love you forever. And I think as a Lobo coming from the state of New Mexico, coming from Roswell, it just was a perfect fit. It just stirs me. I still get chills thinking about it and, and to be still involved all these years later. Being a Lobo athlete is home. Home is where the heart is, and I'm exactly where I want to be in regards to being a part of Lobo football and an ambassador for life.